Well, how are you all? I've been saying you saying to you about the placement of nadis. If you watch my previous video, you would have known very clearly as to the power and the impact of the nadis in your life and how nadis are playing such a significant role in determining how your life will be how the powerful presence of your life is going to be and how you are going to experience wonderful life and i've shared with you in detail about how nadis are like the powerful highways through which energy flows through which prana flows it's very very fantastic so now i'm going to be speaking to you about how does nadi are placed in our body i happen to speak to you about ida pingala and sushma so let me tell you ida is placed on the left side of the body pingala is placed on the right side and sushma is in the center the gandhari is placed on the left eye the hasti jiva on the right eye the pusha in the right ear yashasvini in the left ear alambusha in the mouth kuhu is in the reproductive organs and shankini in the anal region in this manner if you happen to look at it the 10 nadis are situated at the openings of the body everything is like an opening right so the 10 openings are governed by these 10 nadis the way in which you know these nadis operate so essentially if you look at the people who have very little eyesight you know they you know the right eye is not having a good vision the yogis used to advise or give them a process to work on hasta jiva hasti jiva and if the left eye was not very good then gandhari was one of the very very powerful nadi which was worked by using and inducing certain breathing practices in a similar way everything at the end of the day so when we want to see certain things or when we want to enhance our perception we work on gandharvi gandharvi gandhari that is the left eye and also we work on hasta jiva that is the right eye so our ability to perceive the information in the world becomes at its best we have the practical applications of the nadis in similar ways when we love to hear powerful things we got to work on our pusha which is the right ear the pusha nadi which is on the right ear and yashasvini which is on the left ear and alambusha which is the mouth is very very important all this through ida and pingala ida is on the left nostril pingala is on the right nostril the three main channels that's what i described to you that is ida pingala and sushma are located in the pranic passage there's a kind of a pranic passage that we have and these 10 nadis are arranged inside the body now let me tell you that these nadis also have a very very powerful association with vayus which are associated with the nadis they are pranavayu apanavayu samanavayu udanavayu and vyanavayu and i will talk about these vayus and its correlationship with the nadis in my another video very very important that you are able to understand the essence of nadis because without nadis life is not possible they are the pathways through which pranavayu flows good day everyone and it's what is controlling all the nadis good day everybody i will see you in another video by which is speaking to you about the why use and its relationship 
with the Nadis. Good day. This is Karthik Puvanam. I'm a leadership coach and author. Have a fantastic time.